Hey there people of the internet. Today we're going to talk about how to make money with your YouTube channel in a very unorthodox way. You should know that if you are looking for something easy, something that's going to be extremely quick, don't watch this video. You will be very disappointed. The information that I'm about to give to you is very powerful. It's also very crazy. There are many YouTubers who will look at me like I have lost my mind. But what I'm going to do is tell you what I'm doing for my channel and you can follow along. One of the things you have to do that's really crazy is forget about subscribers. I know people will tell you get a lot of subscribers. Well, YouTube doesn't work that way. Let me take you back. Started this channel in 2009. There was a period of time I would put up a video and I would have two, 300 subscribers, but my video would get three, four, five, six, seven hundred, maybe a thousand views. The video inventory was much smaller back then. It's the converse now. You can have 150,000 subscribers. You might get 10, 20, 30,000 views. And even those are not all YouTube subscribers. This is how it works. Your videos are recommended. Uh, YouTube recommend, that's the biggest way you get views. Trying to get more subscribers without understanding how YouTube works is just gonna leave you frustrated. YouTube does not send out an alert to all the subscribers you have. This started for me roughly 2012-ish going into 2013. I just noticed the switch and it was just like, what the hell is going on? One of the things that I've come to understand is if you follow a few simple rules, you can make money. And the first thing is decide to make money. Once again, I told you the information here is crazy. Many people will say this video is just wrong information, but I'm telling you what I'm doing. You should forget about subscribers and build an email list. I went ahead and I recently deleted everybody on my email list because I'm just restarting my brand, I'm restarting the channels. And I realized something, you have more control. Understand, YouTube, which is this phenomenal, it's a great resource, but YouTube is out for YouTube. They're not out for you. The second part of this crazy information is to design your video around one thing that you want people to do. I know it sounds crazy because there's what you want to do, there's what you want to put out, you have a story, you have things you want to share. Chances are, even if your videos are amazing, they will not be seen because of the way that YouTube works. This isn't some in indictment on YouTube. I love YouTube, I'm not going anywhere. But I'm just telling you how it works in my experiences over the last eight years. Unlike many other YouTubers, I create and sell my own products. A different game for me. If you wanna make money and not have your income due to an algorithm change seriously impacted, think about setting up your channel in a different way. You can still talk about all the stuff you wanna talk about, you can still put that stuff out, but you're gonna to have to make some changes with your messaging, some other things. There are some good things that you should do. You should work on your thumbnails. You should work on your titles. You should do tags and keep, you should do all that. You should have a description. But if your video isn't recommended by the YouTube recommendation engine, not really gonna go far unless you put paid traffic on it, which I know many people were like, no, don't do that. Uh, you'll have people will say, I've never put paid traffic on any of my videos, I refuse, I'm not doing it, it doesn't work for me. Once again, this is if you're selling something, which will bring me to my third point. You should be selling something. I don't care what it is, you should figure out something that you can sell to people that they want. It's gotta be some because what's gonna happen, let's go back to the things with YouTube. More and more and more people are coming to YouTube. So the video inventory is just gonna get larger and larger and larger. And YouTube's gonna have to figure out a way to recommend the best videos, which means that if you are not doing what YouTube wants you to do, you will not be seen unless you take matters into your own hands, which is what I did. I noticed this is happening. I use paid traffic on this channel. Now I don't go out to Fiverr or any of those. I don't buy that. Now I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about through Google AdWords. You can promote the video. It's cool. YouTube approved. They're not going to ban your channel or anything like that. You must have a deeper strategy. I am unlike most YouTubers. Uh, I'll be 51 this year, right? It's a whole different game. I am not looking to be a speaker. I'm not looking, you know, I used to live in Japan. I lived in Hawaii. I did a lot of that cool stuff. I don't need to do that anymore. I'm just about having fun, educating people and making money. I know that's really bad. That's so bad. It's a very bad thing, right? But that's what I'm here for. And if you follow these steps, you can make money too. This isn't for everybody. There are many people who have a story to be told. They wanna to create these wonderful videos and stuff. 
I get it, that's your thing. But if you wanna make money going forward and realize what's gonna happen, because many people feel that YouTube is crowded already. No, it's not. There's so much more that's coming. There's so many more things that are coming and there's gonna be so many people creating channels, starting YouTube businesses, that if you want to stick your stake in the ground, the time is to do it now. Let's talk about that email list. There's something that's coming that's called influencers. It's gonna be a huge thing that's gonna grow for the next decade. These are people who have YouTube channels, Instagram accounts, Facebook pages, whatever, that brands will approach and say, hey, can we get a piece of your traffic? Most YouTubers or influencers have no email list. When the brand comes to you, they're just like, how many views does your channel get? How many followers do you have, right? Well, what if you could tell the brand that I have an email list of 50, 60,000 people and they're deeply engaged in my topics? That's a whole different conversation. That could be literally three to 10 times more money from the same brand. Here's another tip. Treat your YouTube channel like a business. This is something I've always done and I'm about to take it up a few notches because have a business plan for your YouTube channel. Now what's the business plan for your YouTube channel? A way that you're going to make money. I'm gonna create videos, I'm going to have my thing that I use to make money and you're gonna have a detailed plan on how you're gonna make money with it. This is what happens. There are many YouTubers who have become accidentally financially successful. If you set them down and say like, hey, how did you start making money? And they'll tell you, make great content, upload on a consistent schedule, then you'll do some research to see someone who doesn't do that and they're making a ton of money. A lot of things go into being successful on YouTube. There is strategy, there's a little bit of luck, there's a lot of hard work. If you treat it like a business and know who you're gonna talk to, I'm restarting this channel. It's for budding entrepreneurs, baby hustlers, folks who are just getting started, trying to make some money. With the rebrand, I'm doing things very differently and I'm following all the advice that I'm giving you in this video. One of the most important things you can do to really make your YouTube channel pop is learn how to tell a story. I'm gonna give you some tips on how to do that. Read more, I know, I know I just cursed you, right? You actually have to go, no, seriously. Read comic books, read novels, read sci-fi humor, do a lot of reading. When you're developing your script or theme for your YouTube videos, Learning how to tell a story and keep people engaged will go a long way into you making money. Because here's the thing, whether the YouTube algorithm recommends you or not, or if you've even put paid traffic on it, if the story is whack, if the video is whack, it's not going anywhere. There you go, hopefully that wasn't too painful. If you wanna see me do this stuff, it's real simple. Go below, get on my email list, and each time I upload a video, I'll send you an email and you can see that I'm actually doing all of the things that I told you about in this video. So that's it. This is Glendon Cameron, founder of HustlersKungFu.com. Maybe you'll learn something, maybe you won't.